I wonder what Buster's going to learn at school today. Oh, a volcano. Wow. They're going to do an experiment. The teacher is showing them what to do. First, a drop of white powder. Then three drops of food coloring. Then some vinegar to make it all bubbly. Wow, it looks like an erupting volcano. Isn't that amazing? Everyone is so excited. They're going to do the experiment all by themselves. What a mess. It looks like Bandit didn't do it right. Oh no, Scouts didn't go right either. Maybe Buster? Buster has made just as much mess as the others. Why isn't it working? Can Ash get it right? Buster is going to check. Ash is still putting ingredients in. Whoa! It worked! Nice work, Ash! But how did Ash get it right when everyone else's went wrong? Oh, he followed the instructions on the board. What a good idea. The teacher is proud of Ash. Now the others are going to try again. But first, they check what they need to do. One drop of white powder. Then three drops of food coloring. Then some vinegar to make it all bubbly. Hooray! It's working! The volcanoes are all bubbling over. Don't they look great? Good job, everyone! It's amazing what you can do when you follow the instructions. The teacher is so proud of everyone. Hey there, Buster. What's that poster there? Hmm, a fire truck? Sure looks exciting, doesn't it? Look, it's Ashley the fire truck. I think Buster wants to join the fire brigade. Go on, Buster. Time to get ready for your first day on the job. Just a few little changes and... <laughs> wow! Look at that! Buster really is a fire truck. He's got a ladder, a siren, and a water hose. Uh-oh, the fire alarm. There's a fire somewhere. Ashley has to go and take care of it. You stay here, Buster. Hey, it's Tony the truck. Watch out for that puddle. Oh no! That falling box started a fire at the fire station. What are we going to do? Quick, Buster the fire truck, put that fire out. Uh-oh, the fire has spread to the roof. Keep blasting water, Buster. Hooray, Robin is here to help. And Ashley's back too. <gasps> you can do it if you work together. Two fire trucks are better than one. Phew, the fire is out at last. Nice work, Buster and Ashley. <laughs> It's that poster again. Now it's Buster on the poster. Whoa, you really are a hero, Buster. Buster. Scout, Bandit, and Ash are having a race. <laughs> Buster and Bandit are neck and neck. Oh, but Scout's dashed into the lead. Whoosh. <laughs> Scout won. Nice work, Scout. She really is super speedy. <laughs> What's that noise? Thunder? Oh no, it's a storm. They should take cover or they'll get all wet. Whoa, that was close. Ash nearly skidded into his friends on the wet grass. Wait a minute, that gives Buster an idea. Whoosh, skidding through those muddy puddles is great fun. They could play a game, see who can skid the furthest. What a great idea. Bandit is going first. Swish. He skidded all the way over there. But Scout thinks she can do better. Vroom. 
Whoa! Scout went even further than Bandit! <laughs> now it's Ash's turn! <laughs> he's so little, he's spinning round and round! He's all dizzy, but he's gone the furthest yet! Last up, it's Buster! Whoosh! Uh-oh, he's getting out of control! Whoa! Huh? Oops! Mm. Buster splashed oh. Mommy with mud! Mm. Looks like it's time for all the little vehicles to get back home. They're back at uh. Buster's house in no time. Huh? But wait, they oh. can't go inside until they're Ooh. all cleaned up. Um. <laughs> Mommy's going to use the hose to wash all the mud off. Splish splash! <laughs> 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 there, now all four of them are clean again. But even so, that skidding race was so much fun. Look, it's Buster the Bus on a bright new morning. What's he going to do today? What's that? Seeds? Whoa! Buster's going to grow some fruits and vegetables. Buster heads to his vegetable patch and takes a look at the instructions. First, he needs to dig a hole to plant the seeds in. Buster starts digging. Oh dear, this could take a long time. But look, there's Diggly. He'll be able to help. Diggly's the best at digging, and he's always happy to help his friend. Diggly will have holes for the seeds dug in no time. There, no problem. Now Buster plants all the seeds in the holes and looks at step two. Sunshine. The seeds need sunshine to grow. But uh-oh, it's a cloudy day. But look, there's Monty, the hot air balloon. Maybe he can help. There, Monty's pushed the cloud away. Now the seeds are growing. Now, step three. Rain? Looks like another job for Monty. He's hopping on the cloud and perfect. Now they just have to wait for the seeds to grow. Many days pass. The plants get bigger. Then one bright morning, Buster checks his calendar. Today is the day! <laughs> Look! Red tomatoes, orange pumpkins, yellow sweet corn, green beans, and purple eggplants. Well done, Buster! Look at all the colorful fruit and vegetables he's grown. Now he can share them with his friends. <laughs> it's evening time, and Buster's cousin Bandit is coming for a sleepover. <laughs> this is going to be so much fun. First, it's time for a snack. I wonder what it will be. Oh, wow, cookies. They look so tasty! Buster and Bandit love cookies! There, one each! <laughs> Yummy! Now Mommy's put them away. But Bandit knows where they are. Bandit and Buster have such a fun evening playing together. But then it's time for bed. They want to stay up longer, but Mommy says no. Hmm, I think Bandit has an idea. I wonder what he's whispering. Now, everyone's fast asleep. But what's this? Bandit's waking up. Buster, too! They're sneaking back downstairs. Oh, Bandit is going to steal some more cookies. That's very naughty. Oops, that made a loud noise. Mommy's caught them. She's very disappointed in Buster and Bandit. The two little buses are very sorry. They'll go back to bed now as they're told. But the next morning, 
Buster and Bandit have surprised Mommy by making breakfast. They wanted to show how sorry they were. Gather round and hear the fairy tale of Buster the Wizard. There's Buster the Bus. Looks like he's driving through the enchanted forest. But wait, what's this by the road? I think it's a spell book. Wow, Buster can use that to do magic. Look. It's Scout, Terry, and Jessie in the town square. I think Buster's going to try casting some spells. Let's see now. Whoa! A wizard's hat! Buster really is doing magic. I wonder what spell Buster can use to help Terry. Abracadabra! Wow! Buster made the plants grow. Nice work, wizard Buster. <laughs> what other spells are in the spell book? The B spell? <laughs> oh, look! Buster turned Scout into a bee! She's having so much fun flying around! I think Jessie wants to fly too! What spells are there for that? Bubbles? <laughs> Cool! Jessie's floating around in her own bubble. Nice work, Wizard Buster! Oh, look, he's very sleepy. Time for a nap, Buster. Uh-oh, I think something's gone wrong. The magic is out of control. Quick, Buster, you've got to put everything back to normal. Hurry, Buster! All the spells are canceled. But I don't think Buster's friends are very happy with him. Buster's putting the spell book back where he found it. And that's the end of the fairy tale of Buster the Wizard. It's Buster and Robin. Buster looks like he's enjoying that bubblegum a lot. What's that? A message in a bottle. I wonder what it is. Whoa! It's a treasure map. X marks the spot. Buster and Robin are going to find the buried treasure. Now which way should they go? There's the jetty. And look, there's the desert island. They found it. Uh-oh, the water is full of sharks. They'll need to find a safe way across. Look, it's Katrina, the steamboat. She's stuck on the beach. She could use a push back into the water. That's it, Buster. Well done. Great. Katrina is back on the water. But oh dear, there's a hole. Katrina could sink if someone doesn't fix it. I think Buster has a plan. I wonder what he's doing with the bubble gum. Oh. He's using the bubble gum to block up the hole. Very clever, Buster. The sharks won't catch them now. Next stop, the desert island. Great, Buster's arrived on the island. Now he just needs to find the treasure. It's around here somewhere. There, X marks the spot. Buster's digging down. Wow, a treasure chest. Look, a coin. I wonder what Buster will use it for. Look, Diggly is working on Katrina, fixing up her leak. Oh, Buster is using the coin to pay Diggly. He's helping Katrina get fixed to say thank you to his new friend. What a fun adventure. It's a sunny day in the park, and everyone is having a great time playing together. Look, Buster has a skipping rope. Ready, Buster? That's it. Hop over the rope. Phew, that was tiring. What a great day. And now it's time to go home. But uh-oh, that's an awful lot of mess they've left behind. Buster doesn't want to clean up. But look, Scout and Diggly are stopping him. They can't leave all this behind without cleaning up. It won't take long to clean up. It could even be fun. Scout's grabbing the skipping rope to show how easy it is. All the toys need to go back into the toy box. <laughs> Bouncing the soccer ball between them. <laughs> this is fun. 
Diggly's collecting up all the small toys. Passing the toy box between them, this is almost like a game. Next, the cone. Look, Scout's catching them on her bonnet. Now Buster's collapsing the goal. Nice work! Everything is back in the toy box. You're all done! That wasn't so hard. Oops, Buster nudged the toy box and now it's rolling off down the hill. Buster, Scout, and Diggly are all chasing after it as fast as they can. The toy box is tumbling off the road. Oh no, it's fallen over and all the toys have spilled out. After all that hard work, what's Scout up to? <laughs> She's right, they can have just as much fun cleaning it up all over again. Everything will be cleaned up again in no time. There, well done everyone. Buster and Daddy Bus are having a day out at the park. Uh-oh, careful, Daddy. They're going to play some soccer together. It's time for kickoff. Buster passes the ball and... Uh-oh, looks like Daddy hasn't quite got the hang of this. But Buster shows him how it's done. Time for a penalty shootout. Buster shoots and he scores. Oh no, Daddy Bus, are you all right? Phew, he's okay. Now it's Buster's turn to be in goal. Daddy looks determined. Whoops, the ball's gone flying up in the air. Oh look, it's Ash and Mommy Fire Truck. Buster is inviting them to join the game. Great idea, Buster. It's buses versus fire trucks. Let's go! Buster takes the ball. Ash dives in front. Mommy shoots for goal and she misses. Oops. I think Buster has another idea. I wonder what it is. Ash and Buster are teaming up. It's now kids versus parents. Who's going to win? Ash starts. Daddy takes the ball, but Ash tackles him. He passes to Buster, and Buster scores! Go, Buster! What great teamwork, everyone! They are both very tired as Daddy drives Buster home after a great day out. Oh look, it's Mommy Bus! Buster waves goodbye to Daddy Bus. But wait, Buster is giving Daddy Bus the soccer ball. <laughs> he does need the practice. I wonder what Buster and Digger are doing. <laughs> Wow, who painted that? Looks like you guys want some ice cream. <gasps> Digger, <laughs> that is one big ice cream cone. Oh look, here comes Iggy, the ice cream truck. Buster and Digger want Iggy to help make them the giant ice cream. Now let's see. Oh, cherries. Mmm, that's a delicious flavor. Let's pick that. Wow, look at all that ice cream. Right, next we need a blue ice cream. Blueberries? Perfect! <laughs> that is looking so good, Buster. Okay, yellow next. Bananas, good choice. <laughs> <laughs> you want more? Okay, this has to be the last flavor, otherwise it will be too big. Apple it is. This is going to be one tasty ice cream. <laughs> one last effort, Iggy. That ice cream looks quite wobbly. Steady as you go, Digger. Robin has come to get Scout so that she can find out what Buster and Digger have made for her birthday. You better follow Robin, Scout. Whoa. Happy birthday, Scout! <laughs> that is the biggest ice cream I have ever seen! Oh no, Digger! Watch out, Scout! 
That was close. <laughs> Blow the candle out, Scout. Now you can all tuck into the ice cream. <laughs> yum, yum. <laughs> hey there, Buster. Looks like a hot day out in the desert. Whoa, look at that ahead. A big mountain with smoke rising from the top. What was that? It's Frida the sports car. She's speeding off toward the Smoky Mountain. I think she wants to race. Buster and Rita are speeding across the desert together. Rita is faster. Go on, Buster, you can do it. Buster is using that ramp to jump after Rita. Phew, that was a fun race to the top. But look, what's that? Hot molten lava? I think this is a volcano. It could erupt at any moment. Uh-oh, Buster. Careful of that rock. Oh, no. It's fallen into the lava. Phew. Nothing happened. Oh, no. I think the volcano is erupting. Quick, guys. Get out of there. Oh, no. There are fireballs shooting out of the volcano. Look out. They'll be really hot. Oh, no. Rita is stuck in the sand. Buster is being brave and going to help his new friend. Great job, Buster. Now quickly, drive away. Faster, faster. Phew, that was a close one. Here's Ashley the fire truck. She doesn't look pleased. She's going to have to put out all the fire. Buster and Rita aren't saying anything. They didn't mean to set the volcano off. <laughs> that was close, but Buster made a brand new friend along the way. Bye, Buster. Bye, Rita. Buster the bus and Scout the car are playing soccer. Buster shoots. Goal! Well done, Buster. Great work. Whoa, it's a soccer bus. He plays for the big bus soccer team. He wants Buster to come try out for the team. But oh no, Buster is too shy. Scout encourages him and Buster says okay. He'll come to the big game tomorrow. Scout is very proud of her friend, but Buster is still nervous. That night, Buster is sleeping peacefully in his garage. Buster dreams he's playing on the big bus soccer team. The game starts, but oh dear, the buses play rough. Now it's Buster's turn in goal. He tries to save it, but oh dear, the soccer buses don't look very impressed. Poor Buster, he's tried so hard. Phew, it was just a bad dream. But now Buster's even more nervous about trying out for the team. Scout does her best to encourage him. Buster can do it. She believes in him. <laughs> now it's time for the big game. Robin blows his whistle and the game begins. Oh no, the red bus has been injured. They can't play anymore. Buster will have to step in. Go on, Buster, you can do it. Buster kicks the ball, and the game goes on. Buster is going in goal now. The blue bus takes a shot, and... Buster saved it! Well done, Buster! You did so well! Hooray! That was so much fun! Look! Buster has arrived early for school today. There's Scout and Diggly. Whoops! Buster slipped on some oil. Oh dear, the blackboard is wrecked. Scout flipped too. Phew. Oh no, the clock is broken too. What a mess. And here comes the teacher. They'll need to clean everything up really quick. But the board is too heavy for Scout, and Diggly can't pick up the letters. Oh. 
Buster tries to fix the clock, but there are so many pieces. I think Buster has a plan. Uh -huh. They can swap oh. jobs. <laughs> Scout can collect up all the letters. <laughs> then Diggly and Buster can lift the blackboard together. <laughs> Scout knows her ABCs. She can put the letters back. Now for the clock. Diggly can fix that. He loves fixing machines. There, all done. Just in time. Here comes the teacher. Well, everything looks normal. <laughs> Apart from that letter. <laughs> and the time isn't right. <laughs> and the number. One, two, three, four. Good as new. Look, there's Scout. And there's Buster. I think they're playing tag. What's Buster seen? Oh, wow! A maze! Scout is going inside. Go on, Buster. Try and find her. I wonder which way Scout went. There she is! Off they go, winding their way through the maze. Which way should Buster go now? This way. Oh, look! A yellow flower. How nice. A few more turns and... Which way this time? This way. Wait a minute. It's that flower again. Buster's gone round in circles. Maybe if he backs up, he can find his way out? There's Scout. She looks lost, too. Whoa! Buster and Scout have found each other. Thank goodness. But now, they need to find the way out. Scout is balancing on Buster's roof. Maybe she can see a way out. There it is! Good job, Scout! They're speeding off towards the exit. But which way is it? Oh dear, they're still lost in the maze. Look! Tire tracks! They can follow those all the way to the way out! Good thinking, Buster! There's that flower again! A little further and... Hooray! They made it out! Great teamwork, guys! Look! It's Rita the sports car! She's speeding into the maze! Oh well! I guess Buster and Scout will have to help her find her way out! Look! It's Buster the bus! But whoa! He sure looks sleepy. He's driving off the road. Oh no! Buster's ended up in the muddy puddle. And now he's stuck. Poor Buster. How will he get out? The next morning, Scout visits Buster's garage. But oh dear, Buster is nowhere to be found. Where is he? But look, muddy tracks. Scout is following them to see where Buster is. There's Diggly the Digger. Scout tells him Buster's missing. They need to find him. Scout and Diggly search together. Look, a trail of sweets. Where could it lead? Whoa, what was that? Aw, phew, it's just Robin. Scout explains that Buster is missing, and Robin agrees to help search too. They'll have a better chance of finding him if they work together. Poor Buster is lonely and cold. Scout looks behind the trees. Diggly looks beside the rocks. What's Robin seen? Some more tire tracks. Look, there's Buster. He's stuck in the mud. He's been here so long. Robin goes to tell Diggly and Scout that he's found Whoa. Buster. He's just over the hill. There's poor Buster. <laughs> Diggly and Scout can help. 
Working together, Diggly and Scout pull Buster out of the muddy puddle. Now Buster is free at last. He's very grateful to his friends for rescuing him. Now he's back, safe and sound in his garage. It's time for Buster to go to school. He mustn't forget his packed lunch. There's Scout. They don't want to be late. But who's this? A little fire truck? Buster is waving hello. At school, the teacher has a surprise. This is Ash. He's the new kid in school. He's going to be joining their class. Ash is going to Buster because he waved hello. He's so excited to have made a new friend already. Now today, the children are going to learn about parking. The teacher is showing them how to do it properly. Now it's their turn to try. Scout's got it. And Buster. Oh. Ash is sticking really close to his new friend. He's following Buster wherever he goes. He doesn't understand Buster is trying to park. Oh dear, I think he's got on Buster's nerves a bit. Buster wanted some space, but Ash didn't understand. At break time, Buster and Scout are playing. Aw, poor Ash has no friends to play with. But Buster and Scout have an idea. Ash can play with them. They're friends now after all. Now they're all playing together. Whoa, good shot, Ash. It's so nice to make new friends.